Let's open the blind. Walking downtown and I'm okay. He's got it all figured out. It's what they all say, yeah. Everyone's looking at me, thinking that I'm different. Everyone's looking at me, thinking that I'm living. But I don't really care what they all say. So, hey y'all, I know I did not finish Vlogmas, I'm super upset about it, but honestly, Vlogmas burned you out. I wanted to put up things that I was proud of, and honestly, I was down in the dumps. I think a lot of it had to do with I was burnt out from filming, and edits, and uploading every single day. And I wanted to put up stuff that I actually enjoyed, which I did. Um, I didn't want to force anything just to get a video up. I just didn't want to do that. The holidays in general every year just burned me out. So that on top of Vlogmas, yeah. Next year, I'm hoping I'll go all the way through and I'll actually vlog. I just want to do regular vlogs every day or whatever, but I enjoyed the content I put out. I just think that it got me in a really good routine when I was picking up the camera vlogging every day and then I just kind of got down. Um, but y'all know I struggle with my mental health, so it's really nothing shocking, but... I pushed through for longer than I thought, honestly. I wasn't even sure I would even make it through the first week because it's very draining. But either way, hope y'all had a great Christmas. Hope y'all had a great New Year's. We had a great Christmas. Super chill. Family and everything. It was super chill. So I already showered. I already put on deodorant. And y'all seen the other things that I did. My skin is super dry. So... I do have to pick up groceries in like two hours. I wanted to go ahead and knock out some dishes. Thankfully, hubby knocked out some of them. So I need to clean out the dishwasher and then do the other dishes. I think he washed them. I'm pretty sure, yeah, he washed them. But I'm just going to rewash them because that's just what I do. everything that we got in this grocery haul and this is gonna last us for about a week and a half ish we're gonna try to get on a monday schedule so every monday i go get groceries we're gonna try to do that so today is thursday and we're hoping this will last until monday hopefully we'll get on a better schedule so i guess i'll start out with the drink so we got a 32 count of nestle water it's our favorite water that's already put away we got a thing of coke cheer wine sun drop diet mountain dew mountain dew and diet dr pepper they were out of like regular dr pepper so i didn't get that so that's the drinks and i'm gonna go through the food first we get this every grocery trip this is chicken breast this one is 4.92 pounds of chicken you can never go wrong with having chicken breast and i have some recipes i want to do i don't even remember what they are but i have some recipes that i want to do so i needed more of these i do have some chicken breast in the freezer i need to cook as well and then i needed more shredded cheese so this is the same one we always get well i switched it up this time instead of sharp cheddar cheese i got the fiesta blend and this is the 32 ounce we always get the big one and then these are super good if you've never had them highly recommend them they're the lean cuisine garlic chicken spring rolls and they are super good it comes with eight of them i think or no six it comes with six and it's got two different little sections of them so you don't have to open them both at the same time they're super yummy highly recommend these and shockingly enough i did not get any amy's meals once again but i'm just trying to venture out and try new stuff 
So this is the chicken egg rolls. We're just gonna try them. I'm wanting to make chicken stir fry and I thought that the egg rolls would be a good little thing to go with it. And I wanted to try this broccoli cheddar soup. Something quick and easy. You just microwave it for three to four minutes. So I just wanted to give it a try. So we'll see how good this is or if it's not good, we will see. And then I got some deli sliced white American cheese. And this is 0.75 pounds. Yeah, so it's 0.74 pounds of it. So for the queso dip recipe, you need deli sliced. So that. Then I got a couple of dips to try. So I think I've heard about this. Maybe I'm wrong. But I got this mild salsa. So I'm a huge fan of salsa. And I wanted to give this a try. And it's like from the deli, I think. I don't know. I'm pretty sure it is. So got this to try and then i got this spinach and artichoke dip to try i love spinach and artichoke so i'm hoping that this is what i'm hoping it's gonna be and then i got almond milk sometimes i'll get lactase sometimes i get almond milk this time i wanted almond milk got the big bag of mozzarella cheese they didn't have that so they substituted it for two the little ones and this is for my queso dip as well and then i picked the great value unsalted butter and they didn't have it so they substituted it for the challenge butter unsalted seems like a good brand it looks nice so doesn't matter to me it's butter all this stuff y'all may see in a video or you may not i don't know yet but i got lemon because i needed like half of a lemon's juice for a recipe and then i needed garlic cloves so I got a garlic. I've never messed with garlic, but I got a garlic, a green pepper, and then we got some parsley. Fresh parsley is what my recipe called for. So we got fresh parsley, a red pepper, a zucchini, and then I got some peeled apples and they're already sliced for me and everything because a recipe calls for a good bit of apples. So I just went ahead and got them cut and everything just be easier for me because I didn't know based off of how many apples I needed because it was just based off them already sliced. So I just got the sliced ones and it wasn't a bad price. And then I got a box of Cheez-Its. I actually noticed that the smaller box of Cheez-Its was a better deal than the bigger one, which is surprising, but some things it's like that. So I went with the smaller box for a recipe. I got some Dijon. Dijon. Why am I having an issue saying that? Dijon. Mustard. Dijon. I don't know. We got this type of mustard that's made with white wine. And I am going back to my Chef Boyardee because I noticed the great value, the sauce in it is not good. So I did eat all of the cans of the great value I got, but we're going back to the Chef Boyardee. Spaghetti and meatballs, mini ravioli, more spaghetti and meatballs, mini ABCs and one, two, threes with meatballs, and more mini ABCs and one, two, threes with meatballs. And then another mini ravioli. So I got two of these. And I wanted to give this a try. It's the chicken noodle soup and, you know, it's easy. You just put it in the microwave in this. A whole lot easier. So I got two of these. One for me and one for Kenny or whatever. He could take it to lunch or we could eat it for dinner or lunch during the day at home or something. Some long grain rice for recipe. Tomato paste. I've never had these, but they're the great value. Buttery rounds. So they're like Ritz crackers. We're gonna try these. I think my mom's got these and they're good, but I'm not sure. And then the value pack of the Scooby-Doo gummies. And they actually had it this time. This is the hot and spicy chicken flavor. So I got this. And I got two of these and it's ranked as being hot. So I'm excited to give this a try and we shall see how it looks. Evaporated milk, honey roasted peanuts, some cumin, common, whatever. I think it's cumin because I don't think that I have this. So I got this sour cream and onion chips. And these were also, I'm pretty sure I looked in a little bit better of a deal to get the little bag compared to the big one. So I got a little bag of the sour cream and onion and a little bag of the cheddar and sour cream. These two. Then I got the hot and spicy shrimp. And I think I got this one last time and it was good. I'm pretty sure maybe I didn't, but I think I did. I can't remember because I've tried different brands. So I got this. A thing of tomato sauce and this leaf down. And then a thing of Doritos. And then my flaming Hot Cheetos. That's all we got. It was a typical grocery haul. We're trying to get into going once a week. That's what we got. And a couple of things that I was wanting to make is I want to make, it's like ACP, but it's called Arrows Feliz, Feliz, whatever. Instead of it being ACP, which is Arrows Con Pollo, and it's like rice, cheese, chicken. Then it also has like squash or zucchini 
and does it have like red pepper I, I don't know so i want to make that and also want to make queso dip which would go with that chicken stir fry which i already have most of the stuff for i'm gonna have the egg rolls with it i wanted to make this like chicken barbecue apple bacon or something i don't know and i think those are the recipes and possibly this other one like chicken passado or i don't know what it's called i look at so many recipes i can't remember but this is what we got and yeah so i hope y'all enjoyed this and if you have any ideas of things that i should try or recipes that i should try to make i love cooking in the crock pot it's like the best super easy and i just prefer that way but most of the time we don't eat out of the crock pot so any recipes y'all have drop them below anything i should pick up from the grocery store snacks or anything let me know and Hope y'all enjoyed this and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye! Well, I accidentally left this out, but this is paprika and I ordered the smoked paprika. I just accepted the regular. I still love you like crazy